iPhoneBatteryRepair.com presents installation video for the iPhone 3G battery replacement. Visit our web store for pro installation services, installation white papers, parts, and troubleshooting guides. Warning, the content provided in this video is for informational purposes only. Top Techies and iPhoneBatteryRepair.com are not responsible for the use or misuse of the content provided in this video. The use of the content and instructions are at your own risk. Top Techies takes no responsibility in the outcome of the service. Opening the case on your iPhone will avoid the warranty. You are performing this repair at your own risk. Hello! Welcome to our battery replacement video for Apple's iPhone 3G. The case design of the 3G makes it easier to open when compared to the original 2G model. However, the battery is located in the bottom of the back shell, which makes it difficult to access. The system board, along with a few other components, need to be removed in order to gain access to the battery bay. Fortunately, no soldering is required to replace the battery, unlike the iPhone 2G. Within our video, we'll show you the tips and tricks you'll need in order to be successful. To get started, you'll require a microphillips and flathead screwdriver, along with a pin or paper clip. In addition, we recommend the use of a suction cup to remove the touch screen glass. So let's see the battery replacement process in action. Let's start by powering off the iPhone. Hold down the power button for 6 seconds in the upper right hand corner. After this has been held down, you'll see the shutdown slider appear. Shut down the iPhone now. Next, locate the small hole to the left of the shutdown button. You'll want to insert a small pin or paper clip to eject the SIM card. Set the SIM card down in a safe place. Next, you'll want to remove the two Phillips screws located on each side of the docking port. Okay, we are now in a position to remove the glass touch screen. You'll want to start at the bottom toward the dock connector and lift out. We recommend the use of a suction cup to lift the screen up. Slowly but firmly pull up until the screen releases. Be careful not to remove the back side of the touch screen as there are connectors that will need to be disconnected prior to the final LCD screen removal. Here we are pointing out and disconnecting two of the three connectors towards the back. Use a small flathead screwdriver to disconnect these connectors. This will leave the final third connector left, which is held in place by a locking mechanism. This is accomplished by pressing up on the black lever arm with your flathead screwdriver. Slowly slide the screen away from the iPhone base. Note, this third connector is the most difficult to reconnect during reassembly. Okay, step three involves removing the system board and camera assembly. There are three connectors that need to be disconnected prior to removing the system board. These connectors are labeled four, five, and six. Disconnect these connectors now.
Once this is completed, we can now remove the screws holding down the system board. There are a total of eight screws that need to be removed. Make sure to keep the screws in order as some of the sizes differ. Also, please note that one of the screws is covered up by a label that will need to be removed. Here is the screw removal process in a time compressed format. Notice how we are keeping the removed screws in a logical order up above. This will help during the reassembly process. Next, we are going to slowly wiggle the system board out of the base. We start by unseating the camera, which gets removed as you pull out the system board. Start by lifting and pulling on the right side of the system board. As you work the board, it will slowly release. As you can see, the battery is now exposed for removal. Step four is the battery replacement process. The battery is held down by double-sided tape. You'll need to leverage your flathead screwdriver under the battery in multiple spots. Eventually, the battery will release, allowing you to install the new battery. Prior to installing the new battery, you'll need to peel back the label protecting the double-sided tape. Once this is complete, insert the new battery into position and press down firmly to ensure a good bond. Okay, step 5 is the reassembly of the iPhone. We've presented the reassembly here in a time-compressed format. Remember to reset all the connectors firmly and don't forget to lock down connector number 3. We hope you enjoyed our presentation of the iPhone 3G battery replacement. Please visit us at www.iphonebatteryrepair.com.